Peekaboo now! <laughs> Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! That's all yours. I ain't gonna lie, you can have that. But look, bro, we back. Episode three, Life is Strange, the most freest game I've ever played on this channel. It's crazy because these are the longest episodes and I'm not making a penny from it. <laughs> you see what I do for you for free? Yeah, for you. But I know what you do for me. You, you drop calm. Max and Chloe, okay, yeah. Look, Life is Strange. I might have to pull up on a nigga in a range. I know you've been talking shit, but nigga, you in range. <laughs> I can hit you right now. Blow your brains. <laughs> look, no, look, that's not what we're doing today. We're not rapping. We're not rapping, bro. We're not rapping. We're not rapping. And my white girl back for five seconds, and that's enough. Okay, let's get it. Let's get it, my boy. We at uh, Chaos Theory, right? Look what, like, why, why was she looking at me like that from episode one? Like, are we friends or enemies? Nigga, let me know. Shit. All right, Chaos Theory, episode three. We saved Kate's life in the last one. You know, it got hectic. It got treacherous. It got deep. It got emotional. It got really... Look, check it out. Check it out. I got something to tell you. I ate 35 slices of pizza last night and like 10 breadsticks. And I'm suffering the consequences of my decisions. Right now, I could barely sit down. My ass is on fire. My butthole, bruh. I don't know what I was feeling like, but I just couldn't. It was the edibles. It was the edibles. The edibles said, hey, I think you could do like five more. I'm like, you think I, you think I should eat five more slices? Edible like, yeah, nigga. I'm like, for real? And then five turned into 30. I don't know how. I didn't really eat 30, but might as well. At that point, once you pass like six, seven, you might as well eat all the pizza in the city, my nigga. Like, you might as well, right? Okay, here go Max. But yeah, bro, I don't be getting no money off this because the uh, cause the music, but I leave it on because I don't want to ruin the moments. It's art over everything. Until a nigga homeless. <laughs> Y'all not gonna let that happen though. I know that, I know that. Kate. Oh no, Max. It's all right. We saved her, man. I'm sure that would have a lot of psychological effects on you, though. Especially if you care about the person, right? I have something to show you. Beat me in front of the campus. Get I knew Chloe would be all over this. So I better get moving. I'm, I'm hungry right now. I'm hungry. This is not an episode that I could play hungry. I might have to grab a pizza. <laughs> I might have to bite a pizza. <laughs> It's amazing how happy Kate looks here compared to today. She was basically pushed up to that roof. She do? And I will use my power to find out why. This has to end. All these niggas ugly. Class of ugly. You know you're hurting when you don't give a shit about music. No, really, really, really. You spitting. Y'all niggas ever drove on the... Just been driving on the freeway and realized it ain't even no music on. That's how deep in your in your body, deep in your mind you are. You don't even realize it. That be that 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 be that that be that pain for real, for real, for real, for real, for real. The hell is this? The Conjuring? Okay, this is scary dark. Let right. there be. Like, what are we playing, bro? I'm Shadows of Rose. I'm not. Why are we playing Resident Evil? Every time we play a game, it always got to become Resident. Well, wait for Kate. Great. Big ass fucking crusty crab door. Like, <laughs> that shit look like Squidward about to come out the back. <laughs> SpongeBob always forgetting to take out the trash. Face ass nigga. Barricade tape. That's for decoration or. Oh, no, this is Kate. I'm so sorry. We miss you, Black. See, nigga's so fake. Where was you when she was showing signs? It was only me. Listen. 
What's the no? Y'all told me when I rewind, I don't have to talk to you. Y'all said something. That is so damn. That is so damn cute. How much Dana is into this Halloween party? Remix. Hey Dana, how are you doing? Better than Kate. I just can't believe she would even attempt suicide. No, what, what the fuck is this? We, we're, we're all. Come on, don't blame yourself. There are other people involved, like Victoria Chase. She definitely deserves a face punch for pimping that video. Yeah. I didn't do enough to step up. Let's jump her. Now it's time for serious payback. In other words, revenge. So what exactly are you saying, Max? Does this have something to do with why you got suspended yesterday? Tell me the truth. She's sitting like this stance that she's this that bro, I forgot her name. Bruh's in. It looked like she's supposed to have a cigarette in her hand and like some whiskey in her other hand, bro. She looked like she just she, like she just worked a double shift. Look at her neck, bro. Why how did you what the fuck? She shaped like a brontosaurus a little bit. I'm not sure yet. It's complicated. I don't want to drag you into this, okay? Not yet anyway. I'm getting scared now. But people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Like who? Victoria bounced out of here earlier and now you, Sherlock? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. Dana, yeah, I'll true. See you later. I'll remember that forever. Uh, can I use this? Aw, Trevor is a sweetie. Good for Dana. Ah, she ah, she couldn't even she couldn't even say that with a straight face. Trevor's a sweet dude. <laughs> Good for you. <laughs> that was supposed to be my nigga, bro. Like, kick flipping ass nigga. We were supposed to go to the X Games together. It was supposed to pop up on the screen. Trevor and wife Max. Hey, Dana, I've been thinking about you all day. And and and, and I see my name in this already. I ain't even there, but I see my why why am I, why am I in it? How hard it was for you to see Kate almost jump from the roof today. Glad that Max swooped in like a superhero. Okay. I don't have anything deep or smart to say. I just want you to know that you're a good friend to Kate. And I wish she had more friends like you. You have been so good for me when everything else is so fucked up and I'm here for you always. I miss you. Okay, that that, that might be his person. At least for now. If Dana talks to Juliet about this, she's going to wish she didn't. For now, bro. Dana, I hope you're doing okay after today. I don't want to bother you, but I'm writing an article about Kate for the paper. I wanted to know if you could answer just a few short questions. It seems like there are too few answers. Let's talk when it's convenient for you. See, people don't even actually care. They just like, oh man, I gotta get the next inside scoop. What's gonna get me, get me my ratings? Who says ratings? Are we in here hooping? Let's hoop. This is both sad and pathetic. I thought I was gonna shoot a ball into the trash can. Dana, I suck at writing, but I thought I should write the, I should write this so you might not hate my dumb ass forever. I know I act like a tough jocker on everybody, but I never had to act around you. I'm not the kind of man you deserve. You saw how I pussed out. If you need any man money, let me know. Nigga said, I'm not the kind of man you deserve, knowing damn well. Nigga talking like, man, if you're not going to be with me, I just hope that you could find somebody that actually... Niggas don't believe that shit. They just say that to sound like the bigger person and sound mature. Because if you actually tell them like, yeah, man, I, I did find somebody. They're going to be like, what? Now the nigga outside your house at 6 p.m. every day. Okay, bye. Bobby. Oh, Victoria isn't here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time going through her shit. Waiting for you, Kate. I'm out of here, man. I'm on a sneaky ting. What am I doing? I'm linking with Chloe. Right? So Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. I knew you'd come through for me, Max. Let me know what we're doing. Okay, waiting for you in the main hall. Oh, Maybe it's me. I'm going to get caught. High sneak. High crouch. I'm sitting here thinking I got to take her down. Are you serious? I'm, so I'm toast if he sees me. Okay, watch this. Nobody can expel me. Whoa. Not yet, anyway. Why you didn't just do... Nigga, watch this. Somewhere. I'm thinking I'm Ellie yeah, for a second. Yeah. Like, I'm about to just... No. Why won't they fit? Take his esophagus out. Just strikes again. Nigga like me would have snuck by him even if he was facing forward. That's just me though. 
dormitory's main bi okay go bigfoot so what was the otters that was just a, they got separate mascots for different i don't get the otter thing go otters Booyah! oh my god bro hey 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 get it boo yeah like i'm a scary punk ghost more like a scary punk asshole hey chloe I didn't exactly She's have scared, y'all. I saw that. To keep my friend from jumping off the roof. I don't think I need you to prank me tonight, okay? Right. Sorry, but you absolutely balls to the walls did save your friend. Kate saved herself. I couldn't even use my power. My head felt like it was being crushed. And then I had no clue what to say to her on that roof. No, you used don't your be power. So modest rock star. Kate is alive because you wouldn't have got up there in order. You obviously said the right thing. And on Your top of that, is gonna save you us used all. the power of friendship. We need to connect the players and find out who almost killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? <sighs> chaos theory. Didn't you say that it was all about chaos theory? I don't see any control over this chaos. Oh, right. Except for your ability to... Oh, yeah. Manipulate time and space? No biggie. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. I mean, I even got my own dumbass suspended. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? Okay. About Kate. About Rachel? About Kate. Uh, can I ask both? About Kate. I know she don't give a damn about Kate, but what about Rachel? Right. For one thing, there's too much coincidence between the people around Kate and Rachel. Like Step Prick and Nathan Prescott? Not just them. Not just them. It's more people. Yep. I just want to beat the shit out of those particular bros. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. So it's Rachel is the deer, right? Didn't I say this in the epi in episode one? I think you said kicking it. Man, if I say B, her heart gonna drop to her butt. Dead? I'm sorry. I hate even saying that, Chloe. Not as much as I hate thinking it. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, Step Prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? Hey, light turned off. You're suspended. Be aware. Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. See? As long as you're my partner in time, bro. So much for helping me put together a portfolio. Cause if I wasn't, she wouldn't fuck with me. That's a double entendre. She fucking with me right now, cause one, I got the power, and two, as long as you're my partner in time, which means as long as you come through for me when I need it, in my timing, and within my timeline, or else, <laughs> the fuck out of here. You know, like that's what I'm. This, I, look, I'ma chill on Chloe, man. You know, that's been my homegirl since way back. You know, we got some things to, to smooth out. It's been a while since we've seen each other, you know. So, fuck it. Thank you again. So the club is will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted. Look at know, this nigga! It's been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day, and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I'm glad it had a relatively happy ending. What do you mean by happy oh, ending? Katie jumped. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Victoria looked like a fucking place. Irish Martian. And, uh, I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. 
Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I what favor? You your dorm now. Wait! I only... Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, okay, so he... Okay. You turned down the, uh, the advances. He not off the hook yet. Just when I think Victoria can't get any more evil. Bro, why we don't just jump her? To get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out. We should have pulled up a Kimbo, a Kimbo shiesty mask. And just whooped her ass. Chloe the Keymaster. You know it. Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. So, and that's what I. The weed you brought into my room. Here's the thing: Don't when you're in serious. trouble, like we're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. Fuck it, you might as well if get in more. That's not good advice. I'm gonna stop right there. Charges for just entering. I used to feel like that as a kid, though. Like if I came in after the, the time I was supposed to come in or some shit, like shit will not at that point, I'm already in trouble. So you might as well. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. You can rewind if we get caught, right? Might Maybe as well be even later, you know? But my powers didn't save Kate. Maybe I did on my own. Come on. One more door and our work here is done. Like a nigga already gonna get punished, so... Might as well live it up. <laughs> my kids are gonna be so bad and I'm gonna be mad as fuck. And, it's, and then I'm not even gonna be able to do anything because I'm gonna have to reflect on myself like, damn. Wow. What we in here doing, bro? This nigga in here making chlorine bombs. Are you okay? That's it. What the fuck? The security officer should have the key to the principal's office. Uh uh. He's hiding shit. Uh. Everybody here. Well, now we definitely have to get this door open. Believe it or not, I know a little about lock picking, thanks to Frank. I might as well test out my thief skill. Go for it. We're already in this deep. Well, you could look for the key. Just in case. Watch your fingerprints, Chloe. You hear me? Hey, you hear me? Watch your... Look, nigga. Hey, watch your fingerprints. Dead end. Max. Nothing here. It's fingerprints everywhere. Boring. We going to Pelican Bay. No key for thee. We have to find another way in. Ooh, this is a thing in a hallway, bro. Time with Frank, but I'll use my DIY lockpick tools while you come up with a better plan. My plan has a name. Hey, Warren, you busy? Oh, he'll do anything for me. Just bubble hearth, you'll be okay. Listen, I need your physics expertise stat. Without naming names, if somebody had access to the art and science labs and wanted to construct a device that would say open a locked door would you maybe kind of know how a chlorine bomb huh no it's on the table I'm just asking for fun thanks science guy uh, no 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 stay we need you as backup just send the text instructions now yes i'm still all in to go ape with you at the drive-in thanks for the hope women are bad people <laughs> Damn door. Try not to wake up everybody at Blackwell. Sorry, Max. I got nothing. But your plan. a nigga that get taken advantage of, of a, by a woman I'm is an go even worse you. people. Can you stay here and not get caught? I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. The race is on. What you know See about some Lupin on the third? What do you know about Lupin the third? So what you telling me? So you was so you was watching Toonami and shit. You was up late night watching Toonami and shit, so you got a little knowledge on some shit. Let me find out, man. Let me find out. Warren is such a classic nerd. Let's see if I can find those items. No can here. Okay, so I'm looking for a can. The nigga. Oh, my fault. Okay, so I need a sukar. 
Okay, bro. Sodium chloride. Bro, 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 bro. Real shit? We really making... See, I'm... Hey. Hey. Y'all was doubting me talking about... You not smart, bro. You not... You wasn't in AP classes, nigga. So why? So why did I know what was going... I didn't even see nobody say that. I just made that up. Just like every rapper be like, my teacher told me I wasn't going to be shit. Like, they didn't say that. They fully believed in you. And you're going to sit here and throw dirt on that nigga name. She lost sleep over you. And you're going to sit here and say, they told me I wasn't going to be. No, they didn't. They said you could be anything. <laughs> so are you really going to try this? Keyword is try. I bow to your wisdom. Okay, so sugar, sugar, soda can, duct tape, sodium chlorate. Aha. Nope. Uh, Doesn't anybody drink sodas here? So I gotta buy one. Release the crack can. Release the crack can. <laughs> it's all mine anyway. What did you pick though, Max? Only three more items to go. I'm gonna have to rewind for something. I gotta pay attention. Oh. Now, why would that not Gross. be locked? I hate that formalin smell. We're going to get that chlorate in here. Ooh, sugar. Oh, okay. I feel like everything should just be in here. You're halfway home, Max. Max takes what? I never said they were great, troll. You still there? Did you blow up? Still here didn't blow up. Not yet. I need to concentrate TTYO. I think my mom says something too. So I need what duct tape now in the sodium. Yeah. You're an artist, damn it, not a scientist. But this is so not sodium chlorate. Here's the sodium chlorate box. There we go, Max. Always taking the shot. You know you're clumsy, Max. Don't waste your rewind. Okay. Power. Use the damn chair. Thank you. But you knew you wasn't going to let me do that until I triggered it, so. So, duct tape. Only one more ingredient left. Duct tape. This is a big ass chemistry room. Like, I ain't never had no classroom this big. Mr. Jefferson's door. Right? This is like a scene in a horror film. There it is. No, it's not. Victoria's cigarettes? <laughs> I'm sure Mr. Jefferson is impressed. Fucking floozy. Duct tape. Yeah. The tape is mine. Now it's time to show Chloe that Max is the bomb. Okay. Finna show Chloe I'm pushing P. Pushing P P. I got that shit, Chloe. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Bro. Boom. Literally. Yes. Time to blow shit up. Now, when I said you're already in if trouble, you, light the candle, you might as well keep getting in more trouble. So I didn't cool. mean shit like this. This you ready to haul These niggas us. is war criminals now. You a damn. This a this is terrorist shit. Ooh. That was so fucking cool. Right, oh, right, toast. right. Right. Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department. Right. Uh, so what should we do? I was just gonna say, as soon as that thing, as soon as that went off, I'd have ran out the building. I just said that shit was so loud, bro. I'm gone. Goodbye. See you later. Good luck. What the fuck, bro? I'm gonna have to rewind and shit. Nigga, what is we doing? You just standing there looking stupid. Find something. Oh, what? Yeah. Are we in it, bit, bro? Oh, duh, duh. No alarm. I'm not even thinking, for real. My bad, y'all. Right, let me get back in my, my, my manipulation super thief bag. If I can get this bastard open, she can't cheat Shh. Oh, this bullshit fucking door. That's too funny. Welcome to my domain. You are magic. I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. 
the company I keep. Now that was kind of. Now let's find what we want and beat it. That was kind of far. I like that. So far, man, I can see why the principal locks this room up. Fancy faux art crap. He must want everybody to know he has money, but no taste. How can you trust somebody who has a fucking bronze bird in his office? I'm glad I was expelled. Yes, if only the principal had a Monet or Picasso, you'd still be at Blackwell. Eat me. I'm gonna pill for the papers on this ugly ass desk. You wish. Okay, sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair. This is your chance to truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock. She don't never want to do clues about nothing. Rachel or Kate or Nathan. She don't ever want to do nothing. I'm on the case. It's always me, me, me. You, you. What can you do, Max? So did you blow up the lot? Una, <laughs> oh, please. I just wanted to see if you knew your explosives and to see your incredible artwork. Sorry, mom. I ain't read your text and shit. Hey, honey, did you you didn't forget to water the plant we gave you, but don't drown it either, mommy. <laughs> what? What? Max, please call us as soon as you can. We are proud of you for saving this poor girl, and we want to hear your side about this Blackwell suspension. Call us soon. Sorry, mom, I'll call you back in a few minutes. Don't be mad. I can explain. Maxine, I'm so glad you were honest with me. I can always tell by your voice. We always believe in you. Remember, if you want to spend some time back home, the door is all open and your bed is made. Thanks, mom. I'm so lucky to have you as parents. Even though I'm suspended, I still have tons of homework. So I'll great parent daughter dynamic from what i see you have plenty of time to ponder what a fuck up loser a loser nigga call me a loser oh no not the private number calling me a loser this pretty much sums up kate she looked shy crazy in that picture she looked like in the wrong place she looked like me okay briefs kate marsh represents the very best of the students at blackwell academy her gpa is a consistently outstanding is consistently outstanding along with her optimistic attitude and quiet work ethic. Her extracurricular activities with the Meals on Wheels program has been acknowledged on K-Bay 7 News. Her diverse religious study groups has been a welcome addition to the wide range. Okay. As a school nurse, I should inform you that Kate Marsh appears to have experienced some recent emotional, physical trauma. I spoke to her briefly and she was upset but vague and refused to talk further with me. I think it's important that we keep our eyes on, on her and make sure she's not under duress from other classmates as in my suspicion okay at present time there is a security investigation into a controversial video allegedly featuring kate marsh at the vortex club party that has been uploaded onto the internet we yeah we know ow something bit my dick right now only two more files to go it looks like an oil paintings bill awful look at this pile Search it. Look at this pile. Look at this pile. Oh my god. Tumbleweeds. Why is it telling me to search it Tumbleweeds. if Tumbleweeds? Tumbleweeds. Okay, whatever, bro. Rachel doesn't seem so troubled based on all this. But there's not much here about the police investigation. 4.0 GPA. Rachel Amber is a quintessential student representation of Blackwell Academy. She excels in all of her studies and extracurricular activities, which are numerous. Popular with both students and faculty, she has the de facto qualities of scholarship and leadership that is a hallmark of Blackwell's legacy. Her diverse goals include a career in... <laughs> no, I'm crying because I was on Discord with Charles, uh, the homie Charles. But we was looking at the schools we went to on like a rating site or whatever. That shit said 4 out of 10. <laughs> Them niggas was talking about some 4 out of 10, 5 out of 10, 3 out of... I'm like, wait. Maybe we're the problem. <laughs> uh, there's no doubt that Rachel will achieve all of her dreams with Blackwell as the fulcrum. This is Lieutenant Chris Rossi. We just wanted to let you know that Rachel Amber's investigation has officially been closed on our end. We always hope that one of our magic clue, that one magic clue, but once again, Arcadia Bay covers up another secret. Interesting. Man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. Bad Chloe. Bro, what? Brief a 1.7 chloe price is a problematic student at blackwell despite the best efforts of the faculty and administration to guide her academically chloe does little homework and is often willfully belligerent to her teachers she has caused numerous class disruptions with inappropriate comments and rude gestures to fellow students 
She was recently suspended for spray painting graffiti in the parking lot. See that. Even though Chloe is an intelligent student with potential, she chooses to squander it on empty rebellion against a non-mandatory institution. She is no longer welcome here. But she in your office right now. I'm telling you, you should have sent her ass to Rikers if you if you wanted to stop Clo Clo. Let's nab this last file, Sherlock. I just read about you. Always wanted to say nab. Okay, so you are doing something. Dude, I know I shouldn't be going through the principal's files, but it's kind of cool. Just please don't accidentally delete his hard drive or anything. Like you can't rewind and fix it. I don't want to make it a habit. Okay? Whatever, crackhead. You're hooked. Don't talk. Search. Oh, I like it when you get bossy. You're finally learning from the master. That is so cool that my signature actually counted. Go, Miss Grant. Dear Ms. Grant, as principal of Blackwell Academy, it is my, I know this is about the surveillance, but to inform you that our petition to block the installation of a new surveillance system has received enough signatures for the school to regret the plan, reject the plan. It is not my policy to take sides in these matters as we encourage the faculty and student body to participate in their school's operation. However, I did recognize the controversial nature of these cameras and shared your concern for possible invasions of privacy. Thank you for your passion and for the da 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 So Nathan Prescott's dad is a bully too. Right. Oh, Shocker. Come on, man. They don't fall far from the tree. In light of the recent outrageous allegations against my son and the suspension, I can't read right now, bro. It's them 35 slices of pizza. Of course, the situation can be rectified once Nathan is reinstated at Blackwell with a written apology. Along with that, I understand that the, tra the tragic event involving Miss Marsh gives you pause, but I would suggest that canceling Thursday's party is not conductive, conducive to the can-do spirit of Blackwell Academy. I expect you to reconsider and come to the same obvious conclusion. Thank you, Sean. So, bro, bro, just... Everywhere, Max. There has to be some info in the student files. Wowzer. This will so not come in handy. Ooh, shit. I'd drink too if I was the principal of Blackwell. <laughs> That's some cheap ass looking shit too. And nothing here. Weird. This asshole has a spotless record. 3.7, Nathan Prescott continue. Of course, come on, man. They extorting that nigga. What else did you expect, bro? With a stellar academic record and a variety of extracurricular activities included, he stands as proud representative, of course. Like I'm not going to read my own personal file. We got, you got a 2.8, my nigga. What's, what's going on? I expect more of my black man. Maxine. Max, as she prefers to be called, is considered a quiet, attentive student with much potential to her photography. Her GPA fluctuates, and she has acknowledged she should be doing better. Her teacher's back up here, quiet... Her teachers back up her quiet intelligence, though some complaints find her too nervous and nosy. Some faculty members would like Max to speak up more in class and be more assertive. Others would like her to be less so, but this is a common student suggestion rather than a specific recommendation. Update. Despite some recent confrontations with Blackwell security, Max showed herself to represent the very best of Blackwell Academy by stopping fellow student Kate Marsh from jumping off the dormitory roof today. At this time, there is an ongoing police faculty investigation, but Max's heroism is undisputed. I have to make sure Warren doesn't have a criminal background. <laughs> Bro asked if they're looking like Finn from Adventure Time. Uh, 4.0? Okay. We might, we gonna have to keep, like, okay, Max, I'll see what you, keep that nigga on the roster. You got a future ahead of him. He could be a little stay-at-home wife that just works on her passion of taking pictures while he generates wealth for our family and generations to come. <laughs> Warren is considered an exemplary student and represents a long tradition of excellence in science at Blackwell. He has the gift or curse of gab, depending on the faculty. Some have accused him of playing science pranks, but this is not confirmed by his science teacher, Ms. Grant. We hope Warren focuses his academic, I beg your pardon. his academic vision, and continues towards his bright future. Okay, W. Warren. I think we found everything in here. I should go join Chloe now. Yeah, I should go way over here and join Chloe. Max, you better come check out these files. Nathan accuses Rachel of bringing drugs on campus, and my step troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Assholes. If David is teaming up with Nathan Prescott, that's a bad sign. Nathan Prescott the third. Ooh, he's so money. 
And you know the Prescott's dropped Major Bank to bury Nathan's real file. Look, it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled? At least Nathan was finally suspended. Check out that note. Open it. It's just some crazy drawing. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Where are you seeing over Rachel over. in the dark room? That's it. That's fucked up. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Whoa, listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. David M. always helps me follow those he follows. <laughs> this is Nathan crazy. saying this? No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super Hebros. Jesus. David was stalking Kate, hassling me, and now we and know now he we was know all, he over, was Rachel all over Rachel too. Yeah. Oh, we are so going into his garage files. Plus, I'm getting a little paranoid in here. We got our info. Let's bail. But maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include mind reading? The drink? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Clay wants some drink. Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. I know how you see. I was. I told y'all, nigga, but that, that friendship power. Get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello. What have we here? Holy shit! Jackpot! Cha Ching! Wow, sir. That's a lot for. Oh, the that's energy. moolah. Dude, there's five thousand dollars here. I could pay Frank back tonight. This will chill him out after you almost, you know, shot him. Five thousand is crazy. Are you gonna make a big issue out of this? Five thousand is just rewind crazy. And for yourself. I hope you do that instead of lecturing me. Ooh, leave the money, steal the money, chase the money, chase the money. Hold on, bro. Cause look, here's my thing. You doing fuck shit, so fuck shit happen to you, and I might be the catalyst of that fuck shit. Even though, even though the money that we're stealing is to make up for fuck shit. It's still all fuck shit. And also in real life, not too long ago, a nigga took 3000 from me. We don't got to get into that. They're like, Trav, what type of life you living? I'm just a gamer, bro. I might steal the money just to, just to feel better about myself in real life. Whose money is this though? And what is it for? He's an adult. That's what adulting is about. Falling down and getting up every fucking day. You know, let me just say this because I'm going to steal it. <laughs> I'm gonna steal that shit. But I want to say, I know stealing the money is probably gonna lead to, oh my God, where's my money? We need to start an investigation. Oh, look, fingerprints. Oh, look, clues of such and such and such and such. Now we're caught. I'm involved as an accomplice, even though Max is not gonna be stealing the money and it's Chloe. And that's her own thing. She's not even a student here. I was involved. But like I said, I'm gonna steal the money. Oh! Frank knows things about Rachel and. He might talk if he's been paid, right? Right. You See, bigger nice. picture, bigger picture, bigger picture. I, leftover I knew it. I'll take you on a road trip to Portland for the day. We ain't got to do all that, bro. Cats, beer, weed, and donuts, and books from Powell's. Voodoo Strip donut. Clubs. Kidding. Hey, voodoo donut what? was so gas. I ain't gonna lie. I love that shit. I want to go get another one. Did you just leave me in here? I feel like shit for taking that money. You didn't take it, Max. That impish look scares me. Care for a midnight swim? The Blackwell pool is See, you doing swimming. too much. You're You wanna take that risk now? It's been a cray week. We deserve a little mindless fun in the water. We're done for the night anyway. We're rich and nobody busted us. So? Splish splash? You're right. We hella deserve it. Splish splash. Did you actually just say hella? I think I'm a good bad influencer. Bro, Miss Grant gonna be like, wow, she signed the petition so she could rob us blind. That's why she didn't want cameras here. Mm, it's all tied together. This is stupid, though. This is all stupid, but I'm a, I'm I'm an investigation. I'm an investigator. We're in the otter's lair. Big fucking deal. I want that heated water. We still have to play it cool, okay? Even if I'm suspended. You can own this hellhole once you figure out your rewind. I don't get it. They got different mascots. 
Chloe is so psyched for girls night out, so I better follow her evil plan. Also, Max, how many pieces of clothes do you got with deers on it? I know you watched Bambi six times a day as a kid. Boys or girls? You got to go in the boys. Come on, man. Boys, of course. Figures. Perv. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. Like, if you're doing bad shit, why would you go in the, in, in the one that, like, bro, come on, listen. Listen to them demons, man. I guess somebody forgot their Blackwell spirit. I know it's stinking here, but I know it's stinking even worse than the other one. Zach is really careless. Doesn't he know what happens when I'm around? Hey, thinking bad things about you, cool. Ha. <laughs> So this is what we doing. Cool. What are you wearing? Just my crystal necklace and phone. Hot. What are, are you wearing? I'm in locker room, only wearing a jersey, sitting on my foot. What the fuck? I took the whole phone, bro. The thing about locker room. <laughs> What the fuck do you mean, but why? You know why. This must be for training kids. It's okay for Nathan to be hooked on these drugs. Diazepam. Raspasado. I guess I should consider this evolution. Dana, I know I'm an asshole, but I still care about you. Love, Logan. Hey, one thing about Chloe, she gonna get the fuck on. She not waiting for shit. Sex me up. Boys locker room is right. Victoria loves the D. Huh, it's nice to know Victoria loves something besides herself. Small ass balls. <laughs> little ass balls. Long dick, little ball ass nigga. <laughs> what kind of shit was that to even say out loud? I might have to cut that out. This one is almost empty. But you've seen it. Like I didn't just make that up. 69 reasons to bang Rachel. Read it and let's go. Bros will be bros. I'm not looking at everything, bro. That's why these videos be 35 hours long. Like 35 slices of pizza. Oh, no. Dumb as hell. She did that shit quick. Yes, we get it. Otters. Hold on, bro. I didn't see that shit. Let me see. Ass. If you're not diving like Meat Mill, don't dive at all. Just keep it to yourself. Oh, yeah, baby. Feels like a hot tub. And with my cash dash, I'm queen of the world. Bow. Tell me you're not going to stand there watching me like a zombie. Every, dare. every second zombie of this just got to be like. Okay, you asked for it. Pure adrenaline, because why are you risking it like this? Cowabunga! Why, look, an otter in my water. Dun, 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 dun. You are so obvious. And I still get freaked out by that movie, so stop. I can't even watch any of those shark shows. I'll just rewind and harpoon you. Otter's revenge. Cheater. Yeah, you wouldn't know about that. <laughs> Y'all know how to float. I wish Rachel was here. She would totally love being in here at night. Wish you guys had met each other. We will. With all this stuff going on, I'm starting to think everything is related. And, and we I sitting here floating in this bitch like two animal crackers. She almost died today. Your power is changing everything, Max. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not so chicken shit anymore. They was in that bitch like when you d when you dunk the Oreo in the milk and a piece of it break off and it's just sitting there. That's what they look like. Thanks, girlfriend. You know what I mean. You're becoming like this force of nature. More like luck of nature. Come on, my power failed trying to rescue Kate. Maybe I'm just stumbling back and forth in time. For what reason? 
You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. What if I had? Yeah, no, I need to know what if I had, though. Thank God. But what if I had? What if Kate didn't jump, but you would be dead? So it's time to start moving forward in time. And we're obviously connected since without me, you would have never discovered your power, right? So you want to take credit for, for what I'm doing? Like, I don't know that. That's how I discovered it, yes. Fine, that's what you want to hear? That's what Absolutely. you want to hear, bro. You make me feel like I know what I'm doing. And you make me feel like I have a reason for still being in Arcadia Bay. Aw, sweet. So. That's Stop sweet, so Chloe. Humble. You're like the smartest, most talented person I've ever known. More than Rachel Amber? Dude, I'm not her groupie, okay? And I'm sure you have Blackwell bros all over you. Like Warren. You're the bro killer. Gross is crazy. Oh, just go for it, bro. The worst she can say is no. And then she say oh, that you're the bro killer. Warren is nice. X said, nah, I'm trying to get like you, big bro. Let's just tell him Warren is he's nice. Nice. He is a nice dude. <laughs> nice. Ouch. That means friend zone. Right, right, no, right. He's really cool. It was so sweet when he stood up to Nathan. But I haven't told him about my rewind power. No worries. Once you get over yourself, you're going to make the world bow. As long as you're there with me. Don't look so sad. I'm never leaving you. Now I'm getting cold in here. Because we're yapping instead of attacking each other. Otter versus shark style. I uh, think I've had my pool experience for the year. Let's check. Let's call it a draw. Hey man, y'all ever seen otters my ass off fuck a me. crocodile up? Y'all gotta Google that. Or YouTube that. My fault. YouTube that, bruh. That shit blew my mind. They was whooping his ass. Otters, bruh. I feel like we just went swimming in Chlorine Bay. Little cuddly you dudes. You cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Thanks. You would know. See, like this is stupid, nigga. I'm, I'm gone, bro. I'm gone. I'm, nigga, talking about some hide. You no, I'm running. I am. Are you shitting me? Oh, it's getting spicy. It's getting spicy. Dumbass. Dude, hide like when we were kids. What does that mean? I could use my power, or just look for a hiding spot, or both. Where are they? Whoa. Hey. Nigga! <laughs> nigga, what the fuck out my face, nigga? What the fuck, nigga? You can see me, nigga? Hold up, bruh. If he's Where over... Are they? Hello? Oh, shit. That nigga fast. Fast. He fast. Not get the fuck away from me, bruh. Nigga said, let's hop. Like, where are you? Oh, you're in there, probably, huh? You're in the. Hello? My nigga, like. Because, Chloe, where did you go, bruh? Where are they? Like, why can I not hide in this? Let me hide in this. Or maybe, okay, maybe this is the move. Maybe this is hiding. Hello? Anybody there? Better not try any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. I heard something over here. Who's here? Your I mama, nigga. A flashlight and a stick. Why would you say that? Man, it's scary ass game. <laughs> it's making my balls jump. I'm gone. I'm gone, big bro. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone, big bro. Bye, big bro. See you later, big bruh. Oh, no, that's not the way, big bruh. 
Maybe it is. I'm gone. Stop. We are so invisible. Why do y'all like to do this? We could hug after. That was scary. Wait, turn around. They're coming. We have to find another way out. Like, bro. <laughs> oh, this is bullshit. You can't go back to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Crash at my place tonight. You want me to crash where the Blackwell security officer I just busted lives so I'll be safe? Okay. Into the car. They're gonna hear Mater start Again. start up like, oh. Bro, he's gonna be like, oh, I saw a mater leaving. Chloe. F Chloe. I know that motherfucker get three MPG too. Three of them. Willy Wonka? Oh, she got the little cotton candy thing going on. I know she had the pink in it too. The Trix Rabbit Swirl? The Trix, the Trix Rabbit Yogurt Swirl? I miss Trix uh, Yogurt so much. That shit was really gas. Why, why is it gone? They don't sell that shit no more, right? Like, bro, that, that damn cotton candy one, that the pink and blue one, that, oh, shit. Always remember this moment. Uh, Photobomb. Photo hog. Uh, I knew that. I know that was fucking musty. She said, photobomb. Think about the word photo and bomb. That just ejects breath, it bro. It's like a different world from yesterday. Photobomb. I left a skid mark on Blackwell last night. Let the skid mark on your like throat, bitch. We we'll get some mouthwash. I'd like to do something good for my school in Arcadia Bay. I can't even submit my photo to represent. I just don't want to be rejected. Every great artist gets rejected before they get accepted. So you have to enter a photo. Even though I'm pimping the school in town you want to torch. Come on, I don't We have five bands. Fuck a nigga sure. named Frank, bro. Just say shit like that because Fuck I'm Frank. out of here since since you left, basically. If I could find Rachel then pay Frank off, I'm still leaving to start a whole new Nigga, life. fuck Frank. Wish we could just hang out all morning like we used to. Maybe we should get up. I have to get back to Blackwell soon. No you don't. You're suspended, criminal. Nobody suspended my homework. If I don't turn it in, the school will contact my folks again. And Max gets in more trouble. Word, word, word. I'm going to get up then. I don't want to hear this music, bro. I might be able to get paid. <laughs> I might get paid for this one. I'm going to stop talking right now, so okay. maybe I can mute I it. I get dressed now. And to see incredible art. Glad to see you didn't blow up Blackwell last night. Almost glad. By the way, the driving is actually popular, so I'm buying the ticks now. I'll let you take care of the popcorn. In other words, you can't back out now. Ew. Boy, if you heard Still what they said about like you. Factory. See if you can find a suitable outfit in my fashion hole. Turn this shit off. Her. That was my 10th birthday. I didn't know Chloe kept this stuff. That's you? You were 10? Okay, time for some Chloe cosplay. Hey, there you go. Rachel left a bunch of her clothes with me. She's your size, but not quite my style. Max, you don't have a style yet. Ooh. 
At least give it a try. Ooh. You can always rewind back to your chlorine brand t-shirt and generic jeans. You suck. Ooh. I like my shirt and jeans. But it would be cool to try on Rachel's clothes just to see if they fit. Stop second guessing yourself, Max. Put this on and let your inner punk rock girl come out. You can afford to take chances whenever and whatever you want to try. For example, I dare you to kiss me. What? I double dare you. Kiss me now. Nigga, what? Is this manipulation? Chloe is. I was just before this happened. I was gonna say Chloe's really good at like liberating Max from her from her uh her self doubts and shit like that. So she is. She has been a, a good addition to Max's life in that sense. I feel like I'm gonna stop talking about. Oh shit! Let me got R two D two in my ear again. Like, uh, sh okay, sure. Damn. You're hardcore, Max. Now I can text Warren and tell him he doesn't stand a chance. Unless he's into girl and girl action. You're such a dork. Y'all need a third? <laughs> like, I've been... That was priceless when I kissed Chloe. I've been trying she to make it happen. Um. Crazy. Now you got gingivitis on your lip. I see it right there, bro. Look. Looking sick, Max. A couple tats, some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for the mosh pit, Shaka bra. Maybe not. Go on down and say hi to Joyce. Free breakfast. I have to uh, wake and bake first. Shaka bra. I promise not to tell. Let's not rewind and find out, okay? Shaka bra. What's up, my shock up? That's what I'm gonna call y'all. We don't have a name for this, for the uh, the A Trav community. Y'all gonna be the shock up bras. <laughs> What's good, my shock up bras? The fact that she put the photo next to Rachel is so touching. Condoms? Don't be a dummy. Cover you. That's not how it goes. Wow. Oh my god. That smells so amazing. TTYL. Max, thank you from my heart for reaching out to me on the roof. You're the only one who was there for me at school. The only one who truly cared. I have to believe you were sent to give me hope. You did so much more than that. My father is grateful as well. You'll always be in our prayers. Love and blessings. Your friend. Can Maybe the dad not that bad of a dude. He just get, he just had that, that energy to him. Maybe it's just the aunt. It really do be the other ones that like judge you more. Maybe it's just like the aunts and, and shit like that that are really. Because it be like that. It be like that. AK, I'm so glad you're okay. I will visit you as soon as you can. Promise. So it's morning. So I'm assuming David is here. Or no, he's probably at work because I'm suspended. What's ironic is I always hated it when Chloe used my teacher. Ah, oh, this is fucking gross. How the fuck do you know which one is hers, too? Disgusting. Feels so good to wash my face after all that chlorine. And hiding. I ain't gonna lie, Joyce looked like the wife from The Sopranos. What a nigga look- I'm about to play- look. Play your answering machine in front of you. David, this is Officer Corn. Just want to let you know your stepdaughter's car was identified near the. Oh, turn that shit off! Turn it off, bruh! Time of the break -ins. What? Give me a call soon. Are you in trouble again, Chloe? Don't you sleep? Oops. My bad, gang. <laughs> Who drinks beer this early around here? Chloe. I keep expecting to see the sky turn red. What the fuck is this? What is you niggas down here eating boogeros? What, what is that? I'm, I'm all right, bro. That was her, Joyce. Good morning, Joyce. Rachel. Uh, I, I mean, Max. Oh, oh, you startled me. Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. Mm, A's and B. Uh, I probably, I, I probably, I probably do like a pancake, Joyce. I'm dying for some of your famous pancakes. I thought you would have missed those. Ah, you ate more than William. Nah, man. He loved them. Eggs and bacon. I remember 
Undefeated. We grabbed it from the stack. Undefeated so awakening we smell. With the ingredients. I need you to grab me the eggs and milk. Waking up to the smell of eggs and, egg and bacon. Milk? No problem. I love that they still have the same refrigerator. The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. Here. Come on, Max. Oh, my fault. My fault. So my fault. Okay, what the fuck? Why? Where is the milk at? Why would the milk not be in here? You're about to piss me off. Now for the mother's milk. Breast milk? Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I'd love to think that too, Joyce. But we are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. Rachel in trouble. Was Rachel mad at Chloe? Is Rachel okay? Is may maybe? Is there any reason that Rachel might be mad at Chloe and left without her? Chloe could piss everybody off but her. They were almost joined at the head. Reminded me of you and Chloe. But Rachel wasn't as grounded as you. Nobody's I'm as grounded, grounded as me, Joyce. Since when? Maybe that's why Chloe likes Rachel so I'm much. practically cement, Joyce. <laughs> Max Caulfield. Are you actually jealous of Rachel? Hmm. It's only Joyce, be honest. Maybe. Rachel was so much cooler than me. <laughs> you think? I didn't tell you to say all then that. Why has Chloe been telling me she wishes she could be more like you over the past five mm -hmm. years? Mm -hmm. Um, did she really? Five years ago feels like a thousand now. Damn, L mom. That me, what, That's what moms are. century old? <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Moms be yapping, bruh. <laughs> like, why would you tell her it's that? Not all that, Joyce. Voila, a breakfast fit for us queens and a king. <laughs> Go sit at the table. I fuck with it though. I feel it, Joyce. I feel it, man. We had a moment right there, and I appreciate it. I'm not gonna let her know that you told me that, but just let just know, I felt that, and it, and it, it was it was good. I'm gonna sit at the table, man. I'm look. I, I'm smelling the look. I see it. Flip it for me. Let me see what the flip like. Flip it. Flip the pancake, Joyce. Joyce, flip my pancake. Flip my fucking pancake. My fault, bro. All right, sit down. Thank you so much, Joyce. I'm never leaving this table. Good, you can clean. No syrup? For real? Pour some beer on it or something. You didn't finish that shit. I ain't gonna lie, Max. I know uh, them pancakes do get to expanding in your stomach and shit. That's why I already eat pancakes. I'm, I'm more like a waffle. A waffle, nigga. Or like a French toast. For me, it ranks French toast, waffle, pancake. Let me know yours. I think I asked this before, but I'm very passionate about it. Seeing you again ah, oh, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. That nigga's a bitch. Uh, I don't and think it can help <laughs> yourself fit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. I'll never forget what he did in that principal's office. Not to I mention totally what I just what I just found day. out as well. He ain't cahoots with Nathan. I'm glad. 
William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this, and... and you ain't gotta... I know, Joyce, I know, I know. I know, Joyce. Right. I'm sorry. I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, morbid. I want you to have this. Morbid. This my baby was so full of life and light. She was hopeful, positive, and everything she's not today. And this was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. That's gotta hurt as a parent. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? It's not always about you. Chloe, please. It's too early to start picking a fight. Heed instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Nigga, now what stop the whispering fuck? or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, mother. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. Oh, no one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me. I have to use the bathroom. Sure. Run off and pee when you should back me up. Now, who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. Listen to yourself. Come on, what's up? Come on, Chloe. To listen to yourself. He's gotta be hiding shit. Hell yeah, on this. For one. For one, we gonna check no the- No shit, it needs a password. Oh yeah, I knew that. How about step douche? Try again. I need more clues. Try America. Cute. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. Obviously, David's parents. I'm telling you, it's because you don't know how he get when he get his little tickles, man. That's password. why. Nothing in it. Nothing to see here. Hell no. Nah. That nigga look zesty as shit right there. I ain't gonna lie, bro. That boy in lube. They in lube. And look at Joyce. Big, strong, fossil chin ass. You could fit an iPhone 15 between her fucking lip and her chin. I'm just playing, man. That's beautiful. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. Nope. No way, Max. I was finna to say, bro. The laptop. I was finna say. But that's what we doing, huh? We gotta get into that lab. I could yeah. try the license number for the password. Right, right, right. So we're okay. Let's just keep looking, though. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. Yep. And maybe it might. I understand what that means now. Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. It was an honor having you in the diner. Nice to know that gentlemen still exist. Love to talk again with you soon. By the way, the name is Joyce, if you forgot. It might be a useful password. Right, 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 right. No, 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 no. <laughs> Even David Madsen might be an angel to, to my field else. angel, keep your wings up. I don't feel like it would be personal. I feel like it'd be some army shit. It's one of these two for sure. Worst hacker ever. No, don't worry about it, Max. No, way, Max. no it didn't. You Watch totally this. Froze the laptop. Oh, fuck, I didn't. Look, listen, check this out. Check this out. Max, watch this. 100%. Try again. Dumbass motherfucker. No way, Max. You totally froze the laptop. So it is personal? Magic 8-Ball says no. Nigga, what? Oh, wow, it was family. Again. Whoa, spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. But why Rachel David has been care? cutting class all week. Frank and Rachel meet once again. Da -da 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 -da. Rachel avoids a dormitory, followed Rachel to the lighthouse. Instead of stalking Kate, David could have helped her. 
Kate and follow the same path to every class. Overheard Kate and Dana W talking about supplies for Vortex Club party drugs. Watched Kate with her church group. She knows her Bible. Kate stays in bathroom longer than other students. Drugs. Saw so, uh, Kate helping Jefferson after class. Don't trust grown men with goatees. <laughs> yeah, Kate has kept herself since Vortex Club party. Not even church. Drugs. Tried to talk to Kate about the party. She got upset and ran. Guilty. Okay, so that's what that was. This is so wrong. Oh, <coughs> is this is my schedule. Max's schedule. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I better tell Chloe about this now. It's just one more thing to make her sad and mad. That's all we had to see. Okay, so he's weird. He's weird. I'm thinking rewind so there's no traces of me ever being in here, but I don't think that's. I don't think that's a thing. Are you gonna lead the house? Oh shit! You scared the hell out of me, Joyce. I wasn't doing nothing. I ain't find no information, and I was I had to piss. I was in there. Pee, I was in there. I was in there putting a, putting a tampon in. Joyce, I was putting it because you. I'm 18. I'm 18 and shit. I've been getting it for a while, so that's what that's what took me a little minute. It. I mean, you didn't have the right sizes in there. My pussy like a medium to, you know, it's. I was not in the garage, bro. Hey, Chloe, guess what? Oh, shit, the nigga here. Nice breakfast. David, you, you back already? I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night. What happened? Some little shit ass punks broke into the swimming shit pool. Shit ass punks. This is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges. Entitled students taking over the So campus. maybe I should have played the messages so he doesn't sure play it. Black whale students? Who else would do it? And I'm gonna bust them. But Joyce heard me when I played it, so she would have brought it up. Or she would have connected the two. <sighs> Figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber Halloween costume? Why well, you know, know it? Right, Must right. Nice Why would you know her like that? Have some free time off Blackwell. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras so he can spy on everybody. Like he spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just always starting shit, right? You're a total paranoid, David. Not now. You finna hit me? He used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? Is this even a question? Now, guys. You're a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Right. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even threatened me. Right. I do respect your Should have never crossed but me. You don't respect anybody. Uh, you were smoking pot in Chloe's room. No, was That's it? illegal. So is spying on people in your family and at your work. Oh my god. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? Cough what? it up. Is this true, Max? Yeah, you want to see? Yes, David. Why do you have these files at all? I find this very disturbing. Extremely. I do not have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Oh, you're turning on me now, huh? Of course. Women always stick together. <laughs> well, screw you. David. Period. You better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You can't kick me out of my own home. Is it's it my home. Right. Is it? Is your name on it? My name. Okay. You know the law, Okay. Right? <laughs> okay. Oh, I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Start calling around, nigga. Like when I'm <laughs> flanked. And check Have the I daily been? rates. Chloe, for once, just please shut up. Motel 6. <laughs> I My hope fault. Joyce doesn't hate me for tearing into David. Nigga, she said leave. I don't want to see or hear you again, Max. You've hurt me and my family enough. Nigga, this is my family. I'm trying to go outside so he has to look at me. I want to stand in front of him. 
Okay, that you still gotta leave. Joyce, tell this nigga to leave. Max, don't beat yourself up. David earned this all by himself. You understand? Oh, I know. What's up? Max, that gave me chills. And you better not rewind this one. What you thought I was gonna do? What are we doing? We okay, we leave. We leave. We leave. So what's next? Who are we gonna go see? Uh Frank? Hey, it's Frank. When I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank. Fucking. Mm, more than friends. They was fucking, and that's how he got the bracelet. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not going to believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that going to prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Right. Motherfucker better not have anything for his sake. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. This nigga eating dingleberry. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. The fucking, we I don't know. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shitballs. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... Chloe, I got this. I'll be right back. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I appreciate the I'll effort, though. I'll scrooby I appreciate that. Mangy mutt. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. What the hell is this? Ugh, gross. I mean, you're in the trash. What is going on here? Dead birds. Omens. Oh, shit. Oh, whoa. Three? This is so creepy. Yeah. What? Have a very special 18th bird. Oh, that was back in the day. Accurate days. I'm Maxine. Pop here. I'm sorry I haven't gotten in touch sooner. I know your mom is very proud of you for saving that girl, as am I. It, it makes us so proud to read about you in the news and see actual video of you walking down from the roof with that girl. And if you want to come back home and now to relax and maybe go to a high school around here, the door is wide open, love. They miss you, Max. They miss you. You got a fucking strong system at the crib. That's wonderful, bro. Thanks, Pop. It's been a whirlwind here. I'm not ready to come home yet. Talk later. She said, I'm out here in Miami. Doing CSI Miami. I thought that said fucker. I said, oh, so you a real fucker, huh? Are those ants? What the fuck is this? So ominous. What the fuck is... I don't feel like that was supposed to be there. Oh, I guess. Damn, I'm gonna be taking no pictures, bro. So everybody eating booger rolls. How are you? I remember you. I heard about that girl almost jumping off the Blackwell roof. Kate, man, yeah. It was Kate Marsh. I was able to actually talk her down from the roof. That was you? Well, if I had a bottle, cheers. Thanks. Still didn't stop me from getting expelled from Blackwell. But I need to find out who else is involved in this. I'm probably a bigger snoop than you. People pretend to not see me, so I see everybody and everything. Frank Bowers knew Rachel. Have you seen him around? I saw him today, looking more jumpy than usual. I don't know how he hasn't been arrested yet. Sounds like you know a lot more than me, child. I just think Arcadia Bay is in trouble. Maybe you'd like to tell me what you're hiding. Like no, but I'm gonna tell I'm gonna tell her because ain't nobody gonna believe anything she talking about. Like I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Ain't nobody listening to what the fuck she gotta say. <laughs> I feel like I can trust you as much as Chloe, and you wouldn't think I'm crazy. Too late for me to judge anybody. Plus, you're not crazy. I'm just gonna say this. I had a vision of Arcadia Bay being destroyed by a tornado. For real. Could be. Bad mojo is in the air this week. 
Thanks for the warning, Max. Oh, now she now she can be prepared and I don't know. What's up, fucker? Good Lord, bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. Ugh, but I need to get those keys from Frank. I'm gonna spill this shit. I just wanted to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> yeah, literally, I just wanted to see. They knew exactly what was going on. I'm finna spill everything. You show up after almost shooting me? You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. I thought, what, the what fuck do you want? Where is the spilling at? How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look like ass. Aiming a gun doesn't make you any sexier. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. <coughs> in other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. Nah, we getting in that RV. What the fuck you thought this was? There she is, Super Maxine. That's your new nickname around the bay. Sorry, but you did earn it. We're all real proud of you for helping Kate down. Thanks, Officer Barry. I was just lucky. And right on time. Kate is who counts. I'm glad you're representing Blackpool Academy. Let's just move on. I'm not trying to talk to this nigga. Uh oh. I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. Well, don't make me backwash this bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent. Taking over Arcadia Bay? You're not far wrong, Max. I heard the Prescotts are working on some new big land deals. Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago. So I made a deal with him that I can't seem to get out of. Man, if I, I could know, get nigga, one what instant the replay in life. I better finish my breakfast first. Well, well, well. Rachel, uh, whatever the fuck. Uh, oh look, Max Amber. Is that your punk rock girl outfit now that you've been suspended? Thanks for trying to get me in trouble, you tweed bitch. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. <laughs> they just be making up words, bro. Look, I got drugs for sale. What's up? Would you, you got any, you got some shit for me, my boy? Uh. I bet Frank hooked you and Rachel Amber up with party supplies. Nice try. Rachel partied like a fiend on her own. More than me. I doubt that. Like you would know, virgin. Even that pig over there knows Rachel hung out more with Frank. I mean, don't talk to the cop about that, dumbass. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. Okay, so now I could talk to you. We'll chat later, Max. I shouldn't have said. There she is, Super Maxine. That's your new nickname around the bay. <laughs> Sorry. Nathan said that Rachel Amber represents Blackwell, with Frank Bowers. Bowers ain't no student anymore. Sadly, he does represent one side of Arcadia Bay. I want you to stay out of his orbit, okay? He man that rabid mutt. I heard something about Frank Bowers and his puppy. My boy does love his dog. Especially when the dog is your personal drooling bodyguard. You can bet he trained that poor thing on blood. Gross. I wouldn't bet. Where did he get the pup? Frank used to bet on dog fights. And to his credit, he had a revelation. He saved a bunch of the dogs, kept one for himself. He's still a creep. You and that Chloe stay away, right? So, 
Oh, tell some tell the nigga something's wrong with his dog. What the fuck now. You act so scary, but you did save all those dogs. Oh. One, I'm not acting. Two, who told you about the dogs? God. It's actually a great story. You're an animal lover. Could I pet the doggy? I could go grab him from your RV right now. <laughs> I won't even let you pick up the dog shit. Besides, you don't want a leash. You want these keys right here. Look at your eyes dilate. You're worse than a junkie, Max. But no fix for you. Obviously can't just take them bitches. I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now. And then watch this. Rewind it, and I already got them bitches, bruh. I already got them bitches, bruh. No, don't put them down. I got them, right? Got now back to foot. <laughs> Is that? Is that Alyssa? Are you me? <laughs> her life is her, her life sucks. Alyssa, I saw that shit. I'd love to talk, Max. But Whatever, I'm nigga. In Whatever. Hey, check this out, bro. What is that? A bone? Look, I got a key. I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Brain. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. On your mark, get set, throw. Uh, throw. If I throw it in the road, my boy, he's gonna die. Cause why would you throw it towards the road? Like that's so obvious. But is the parking lot enough? Yeah. Get the treat, treat boy. I think we just made that dog our bitch. Get it? Now we can snoop in peace. But let's not waste time. The doggy is busy now, but the doggy, <laughs> the doggy. Damn, I thought my room was a shithole. You're not a creepy drug dealer. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading down the coast to Big Sur and beyond? Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. And you'd probably want me to kiss you again. Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. I know. Just daydreaming. What y'all think it smell like in here? You scope the area while I hack his computer for info. Frank is almost a made-for-TV hoarder. This place is nasty. <laughs> Too bad I don't have my Frank Bowers decoder ring. Are these for Frank, or is he selling them? Or both? That's a pretty extreme lighter. Is Frank going to deal online now? Crappy wife out here. That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. I could pry this vent open with the right tool. No more secrets. Ooh, Frank's stash. Frank must spend all his drug money on baggies. <sighs> Recycle, dude. Of course Frank gets the munchies. Zip, nada, nothing. Zilch. No it's... prize here. Uh... Whoa, what the hell is he doing with that dog? <sighs> This is almost as good oh. as a set of keys. Duh. Curses. Nothing here. There's nothing in there. Okay. Mm. My blade will open any portal. That took me so long to see that. Oh man, Rachel and Frank's dog. Oh no, they was 
they was married. I don't know if I should be touched. Or Frankie B, stirred. hope you read this first thing in the morning. Sorry about last night. I was being a monstrous bitch and took it out on you. And poor Pompadou, there's a lot of weird shit going on in my life. And sometimes I feel like I'm never going to get out of Arcadia Bay. Thank God for you. You're one of the best things I have here. And I smile when I think of us together. Let's just drive out of here forever. Love you always. R.A. Rachel really did hang out with Frank. Well, he was in the morning hanging. He was... He was deep inside them walls with just the balls hanging out. I'm learning more about Rachel than I want to know. Sheesh. Hmm. That was not cool what you did. And don't blame the drugs. You actually scared me and I thought you'd never chill out. I've never seen you act that way. And the next time will be the last. I'm a Leo. And we don't look back. I care about you. Us. So maybe we need to break our routine. She said, I'm a Leo. Oh, brother. True, true. Chloe, look at this. That makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. Right. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? Oh, shut my up. My dad gets killed. You bail on me for years. <laughs> my mother gloms on a step fucker. Now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit. Who hasn't? Fuck everybody. Chloe. Man, shut up. Take some initiative over your own life. That's probably what she feels like she's doing. It's not. She's young. She got time. She'll get through it. Do you notice your dog is outside? Chloe. You can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. Bingo. It's so not fair. I gotta blame somebody. Otherwise, it's all my fault. Fuck that. Grow up. God, you're not the only one in Arcadia Bay with problems. Kate Marsh almost... Yes, Kate Marsh almost killed herself. Such sad, okay? That doesn't make me feel any better about my fucked up life. Get it? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? You blame William? Really? Yes, I do. Damn right. He chose to go out that door and leave me forever. Chloe, your dad didn't choose to leave you. I know that, Max. My mom actually blames herself. Just because she wanted a ride home from work. Sometimes, even I blame her. No, you don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? She said, no, you does. don't. No, of course not. What the fuck you gonna tell me? But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. I can tell it's crazy. You don't want to hear this, but you're still here. Alive. With me. And that is no accident. You're right. I don't want to hear this. Chloe... I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me. She. <laughs> Rachel. <laughs> nah, she driving like those memes when they be like, when you in the passenger seat and the car starts speeding up, and bruh start talking about some. I loved her more than anything, bruh. <laughs> I don't want to live no more, bruh. <laughs> Hold on, bruh. Let me out the car.
Oh my god. What is happening now? What was that? No way I'm able to jump into a memory. I could jump into a memory. Blue Skadoo, we can too. Wait a minute. Someday dad will get one of them newfangled computers. Little chicken head, Max. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Max, tell him. Whoa, hey. You look totally pale. Are you okay? Yeah. I just... Uh... Yeah, I'm fine. Whoa, okay, cool. what? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Well, I might just allow this one into the family album. No. You're the boss. What? Is this? But not the cook. William is here. Daddy. Yes, and we can't Chloe is just a kid. And serve us slackers. Am I that well, far back in time? You mean pancakes? In France, they call them. Crickets. I'm 18 years like old inside my 13 year old self. If you want to eat. Breakfast. How? We. Oui. I volunteer to break the eggs. I'd had a nervous breakdown. I'd had a nervous breakdown over this a long time ago. The Mom first time this happened, to be honest. Whoa. So how many eggs? Oh, is that a Kit Kat? Right. Oh. Like you're the real cook here. I know they never took that big vacation. And when your mom is away, I'll let her know that. Oh yeah, I miss movie nights here. Cookies and popcorn. Milk cookie sodas chips. My family never took fun goofy photos like this. I forgot about this. Yeah, thanks for the day. This is the trip to the Back to the lighthouse. Hello. Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. Oh, this is the day it happened? Work at the two whales. What? Oh, yeah. I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course yeah. I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there Joyce loves William so much. Love you. I have to stop William from taking his car today. Whoa! Yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious no way. food for us to feast you upon. You are ridiculous. <laughs> He'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Now you playing with God at this point. I mean, you kind of you've been doing that, but like what? Aha! You can't hide from me forever. Score! Hello? No, what? I'm hey, I'm kind of per Just making a fabulous breakfast with I'm kind of perplexed right now, I'm not going to lie. Two whales. What? Well, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Why, why not just keep it on your body? Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. I know I had those keys right here. I know it. Forgot all about you, little buddy. Release the keys. Of course. Last time I ordered from Spy Guy Electronics. You can take the bus, right? Oh, okay, the that's why I threw it. Right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. Oh yeah, the bus is great. It comes every 15 minutes and, and there'll be plenty of room for you and, and joys and groceries and and it'll save the environment. She's probably like, what the you fuck? You sold me already. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Uh, Joyce will love this. What the fuck was that about, Max? Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. He somehow still died? Yeah, see. Oh no, it's gonna change. Oh shit.
Get that nigga out of here. <laughs> oh no. Is this actually happening? Like, what are we about to go back to then? This really changes so much. Everything. The trajectory of everybody is different, probably. Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? Max. Never Maxine. I know, sorry, Mad Max. You're not pissed at me, right? Right? Do you want to go hit the girls' potty and smoke them peace pipe? I think Max is hot. She's acting like so weird. You cool, Max? Nobody listened when I said we shouldn't let her in the vortex. Courtney, you don't want anybody in the club. So am I like the new Rachel? Warren, he hooked up with Stella? Bro, butterfly effect is crazy. Oh no, this is totally fucked It's really up. a trip to just think what about how everything change? leads into like... Chloe. David Madsen's a bus driver. Ah! Bruh. Like, did he even go to the military? Nah, this is different. This is different. I was already intrigued, but I'm like beyond intrigued now. This is feeling like the end of the episode. This Friday Night Light soundtrack. What do you see? What do we see at the two whales? A fucking whale. Two whales. Three whales. Got to change the name of the diner now. Goof at ruin. We're no longer friends. We ain't friends no more, bruh. I just seen the level of my mic, so I'm sorry if it's been hella loud this whole Max time. Max Caulfield, taking a break after taking Seattle by storm, huh? Hmm. We thought we'd never see you again after you left for the big city. No, I'd never do that to Chloe. Speaking of, I know she's been dying to see you. Hold on. Chloe, you have a visitor. She's in a wheelchair. Oh, fuck. Now nah, this is a trip. This is a good. Oh wow! 
Like, I know the whole game is just butterfly effect and the consequences of, of altering fate and once what and, and what once was and shit like that. This would fuck me up so bad, bro, because I'd be like, what did I do? I would I would start spiraling. I would spiral and spiral and spiral because I wouldn't know how to, like, damage control this or to, to rectify anything, bro. This is crazy. No, I like this. I like this, man. We I got to see what the next episode is talking about. I'm going to get on top of that. I promise you. I'm really busy right now, but I'm going to get it done. And I hope you guys are enjoying this. And I hope you guys show me that you're enjoying it with that t and dropping calm and following social medias. Rare Hollow especially. I have a broadcast channel that you guys need to join because I'm, I'm kind of like, I'm fucking with that right now. It's a good place to stay up to date with that type of thing. And, you know, that's how I keep everything running and able to make these videos for you without having to worry about what's going on monetarily. You know, so that's just it is what it is. But I appreciate you guys for watching this. I'm going to be back now. That's crazy. Like, how did she get in the wheelchair? I'm trying to think, bro. I'm Yeah, we got to find out. I have to. We, we got to find out, bro. I'm about to find out how many more slices of pizza in it. <laughs>